What's up guys, Muhammad Abdullah here. The Apple iPhone 11 series is here alongside the new Apple A13 Bionic chip, which Apple claims is the fastest chip ever to be put inside of a smartphone. In this video, let's compare it to the Huawei Kirin 990, which is powering the Huawei Mate 30 and the Huawei Mate 30 Pro. Fun fact. The Huawei Kirin 990 is the fastest processor on any Android smartphone out in the consumer market. Anyways, let's get to the video. Before discussing the juicy differences, let's just quickly go over the similarity. Yes, you heard that right. They both have just one similarity between them. That is, they are both 7 nanometer processors and they are both based on the extreme ultraviolet process. Don't get confused by the name or anything, it just means that they are based on a more efficient 7 nanometer node. Now to the main part, where we discuss the Geekbench scores. Well, here, the Apple A13 Bionic, which is powering the iPhone 11 Pro, gets a single core score of around 5600, which is excellent, which is mind blowing. In comparison, the Huawei Kirin 990, which is powering the Huawei Mate 30 Pro, gets a single core score of around 3900. There is still a big difference, but its impact is decreasing every single year as the percentage difference in performance is decreasing. Multicore is where we see the biggest difference as the Apple A13 Bionic powering the iPhone 11 Pro gets a multicore score of around 13800 in comparison. The Huawei Kirin 990 which will be powering the Huawei Mate 30 Pro gets a multi-core score of around 11,700. What this really means is that if you are going to do some photo or video editing or load some heavy applications using these processes, the Apple A13 Bionic will come out on top every single time. And that too, weirdly enough, if we compare the Antutu scores, the Apple A13 Bionic gets a score of around 465,000 while the Huawei Kirin 990 gets a score of around 458,000. Well, there is a difference, but this difference is like of 1.5% which really doesn't mean anything, which is really really weird. These scores show us one more thing, can you guess? No? Well, I'll tell you. Well, see, the Apple E13 Bionic is a 6 core processor having just 2 high performance cores, while the Huawei Kirin 990 is an 8 core processor which has 4 high performance cores, 2 of which are overclocked to get better multi core scores. That overclocking is, of course, good because it helps in day to day performance, but Apple produces the best silicon and that's a fact. Anyways, those were all my thoughts. Let me know yours with a comment down below and maybe consider subscribing. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.